Welcome to the FSK Video Hub. Today I'm going to demonstrate the MyRhino app that can be conveniently used to improve the monitoring of your business or home security system from your mobile device, giving you complete mobile control of your Rhino Alarm Panel or Falcon Transmitter, allowing you to do so much more. The MyRhino app is easy to use and can be used on either a smartphone or tablet device. Start downloading the free app from the Google Play Store for Android devices or the Apple App Store for Apple devices. Type in My Rhino in the search bar and proceed to download the app. register to create an account. Enter your name, surname, cell phone number, preceded by 27, and a password that includes a minimum of six characters, at least one uppercase letter, or one or more numbers. Then click register. Now proceed to enter your email address, which will serve as your username. Enter your unique password and click sign in. Once you have logged in, tap on add device on the app and then scan the QR code on the inside lid of your Rhino Alarm panel. Or if you are linking a Falcon GSM, scan the QR code on the back of the transmitter. Select the type of device in the drop-down menu. In this case, we are linking a Rhino 816. Once this is complete, you'll receive a message on the screen that the alarm panel or Falcon has been successfully linked to your account. Tap on the device icon you want to connect to and the app will then request a panel user code, which will be provided to you by your installer. The app will then connect to your alarm panel and the app will display the controls to manage your alarm system. In a case of connecting to a Falcon, no panel user code will be required. To set up your device push notifications on an Android device, tap on the additional options icon represented by the three dots on the top right hand side of the screen. Select the notification button and then click on the wrench icon. Click on event notifications that you want to receive and finish the setup by clicking on Update. To away arm, that is, arm your alarm when leaving your premises, tap away arm and you'll receive a confirmation push notification that your alarm panel is now armed. You will also see your panel status updating to system full armed. To stay arm, that is, arm your alarm before retiring to bed, select the stay arm mode you desire, that is, stay arm 1, stay arm 2, or stay arm 3. You will receive a confirmation push notification that the panel is stay armed and the panel status on the app will update to system stay armed. Tap on disarm to disarm the alarm panel. You will receive a confirmation push notification that the panel is disarmed and the panel status on the app will update to system disarmed. If you are experiencing trouble or faults with any detector, the app allows you to manually bypass zones by simply tapping and holding on the zone and confirming the action from a pop-out prompt. However, be sure to contact your security provider to schedule maintenance on the troublesome detector or zone. The phone app can allow a user to activate up to five wireless relay outputs programmed on a Rhino 816 panel. By simply tapping on the desired output, the relay outputs can be used to switch on or off lights, swimming pool pumps, water sprinkler systems, or even the geezer. When connected to the Falcon through the app, you will be able to see the AC power status of your premises, the battery voltage of your system, and the status of the Falcon's inputs. In addition, 
you are able to activate the relay outputs of the Falcon by simply tapping onto the desired output. These outputs can be used to open the gate, arm and disarm any alarm panel remotely, switch on lights, etc. The Falcon will also be able to send push notifications to your My Rhino app. An added benefit to you is that you can also rename your devices, zones and usernames by simply logging onto the My Rhino website, myrhino.com, using your existing account details. Once complete, you can now disconnect from your device by selecting the additional option icon represented by the three dots at the top right hand corner of the screen. Select Disconnect Device. Select the additional option icon again and select Log Off and Exit.